If you do decide to run a revolver for defense, you're going to need some items in addition to your gun. You just got to have them. Let's talk about it. On the left, I've got a 686-3 six-shot. And on the right, I got a 686 plus four inch seven shot. So let's talk about it. First, <clears throat> you're going to need a good belt, good holsters. Outside the waistband holsters, tight to the body. I, I like the Galco Combat Master for the four inch. For the six inch, we like the D Ruck, D O R U K, tight to the body. Speed loaders, you're going to need them. Seven shot, you can only get the HKS. For anything six shot, I recommend a Safari Land Comp 2. I would at least have two speed loaders for each gun. Speed strips, a must have additional ammo carrying source. Safari Land is the best. Bianchi, don't settle for anything less. Then you've got inside the waistband holster. The LG5 Sticky is the best that I can find. This can go right into your waistband and, yes, conceal a 4-inch gun. If you want to conceal the 6-inch inside the waistband, you can modify these and you can cut a hole right here and it'll get those extra 2 inches right in. And that's what she said. Also, ammunition carriers. Well, outside the waistband, you've got these for an HKS, double pouches. A lot of companies make them. Galco, Safari Land has these right here, which are great for your six shot speed loaders. Most of the time, I just put an extra ammo source in my pocket, usually on the right side. So, we talked about all that. The only other thing I'd add to you if you're going to carry a revolver is a duty belt. A duty belt is something you can throw on with pajamas and sandals like your Viet Cong. You can put on your duty belt, medical gear, outside the waistband holster. This is an old police holster that I use. Speed loader carrier, usually on the right side. I also additionally add a Leatherman and other pouches you can put additional gear in. This is something that you just got to throw on. You can run it in competitions if you do that. But that's it, guys. I would run a duty belt. <clears throat> Outside the waistband holster, inside the waistband holster. Have all three. Ammo sources, your speed loaders, your speed strips, you got to have them. And then you got to decide what gun you want to get. Your 686s are probably, you know, one of the best fighting revolvers out there. And this is a plus model 4 inch or the 6 inch dash 3. Big differences, firing pin mounted to the hammer, Hillary hole here. Other than that, very similar in the trigger squeeze. Um, I know a lot of purists really like the old ones. And, I, you know, if you can't decide, get both. The only other really good fighting revolvers that I recommend are going to be your Rugers. Ruger makes fantastic GP100s, SP101s, Security 6s. So those would be included into this as well. I hope this video was helpful. I know I tried to make this a short, but it definitely is not going to end up being a short. So check us out. So like, subscribe, and thank you for tuning in.